Hi guys, here Akumaldo Crypto with another Bitcoin update. You have my Twitter. If you haven't followed me yet, please consider doing so. I provide here charts, updates, uh, suggestions and everything, okay? Not everything, but you know. <laughs> so Bitcoin, huh? the daily chart here with my, this is my primary account, okay? Uh, what we have here? We have uh, this setup here that I presented you guys yesterday. W, X, Y, and then we have this A, B, C, D, E inside of the last Y here, okay? And then we have this A, B, C, okay? This is my, this is the daily chart. Uh, the EMA, I'm going to show you guys in a second. So this is the week, the weekly chart. Uh, we have finished the weekly chart with an engulfing candle here below the 55 EMA. Now we have some kind of reaction, right? Here it is. So we don't, uh, I need to change this count here. I'm sorry. Uh, but this, this, we need to see some kind of reaction, but 55 EMA here is going to act as a strong resistance and it's 7200. Which is, a, which is the place that I'm proposing that we are gonna get the wave four for this count here that I'm proposing, okay? This is my primary count, this is my hour chart, and this is my count that, the, that I'm proposing that is, that is in play now, okay? Here we have our third wave here, touch the median line, okay? Third wave, we haven't finished yet this A wave here. We are now, uh, we're tracing for our wave four, okay? We're gonna, we expect to see some ABC, okay? And then we are gonna uh, go down again to put a new low here of uh, perhaps 7300, okay? I'm expecting to touch it again, the median line, or perhaps pierce it, okay? This is the spots that I'm proposing that we are gonna retrace, okay? We might not have a, a C wave that is that's gonna be higher than A. We, we might have a running, uh, a truncated fifth, sorry, um, a truncated C wave, okay? It's not a problem. And as I said, I, I see that we can have somehow uh, 7200, perhaps a bit higher. Uh, th those are my, my short short those are the places that i'm gonna start shorting okay then that, that i'm gonna start placing my shorts um this is my primary count as i see this whole structure here as corrective rather than a motive okay uh, rather than put in a new a new trend okay so this is how i see it um so if you look at this chart here this is a, a another this is a daily chart, but it's a different uh, way of seeing it because this is the inverted head and shoulder that we had that played nicely, right? Here we have the the, the, the neckline, right? The neckline we have, we traced exactly the neckline. Okay, exactly. But we crossed all the, the, the EMAs. Yeah, we, we, have, we have crossed when we were going up and crossed all the EMAs, even the two, the 100 and the 200, but now we are down again, below the 55 and the 21 EMA. And the 21 EMA has crossed the 100 EMA. Okay, but we touched this neckline that is acting as a support, okay? Uh, one might argue that what we have here is a wave one and then a two, okay? And then if we, if we use our FIB retracement too, yeah. You're gonna see that we we don't we haven't touched the six one eight six five okay we have crossed the fifty percent but we haven't touched the six one eight six five okay you might say that this is a wave four but the shape the geometry of this wave four okay if you want to be like a, a, a bull now and talk about oh this is a wave four for in order to in order for this to be a wave four, we would need to have a, this is an A, B, and a C, because this is a clear motive impulse wave down, 
okay this is a one two three four one two three four five yet to be finished it, it doesn't look like a wave four not not in the least okay and we would need to allow this to be a wave one two and a three and this doesn't look like a wave one as i have been saying this look like a, um uh leading diagonal corrective a pattern five trees three 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 and three okay then we have a b this looks like a lot corrective not uh, a motive impulse wave to start a, a wave two here or a wave four here and then we go up okay we don't have data supporting uh, a bull count now as we as we see it okay what we have here we touch the support strong resistance here okay that boss the neckline if we, it's the same thing that we had for our neckline here i'm sorry this neckline here is it was the, it's the same support that i'm marking here in red okay we touched it and we have a we had a reaction at the same time is the the median line of this pitchfork here that's why i think it's it's uh, it, we have this reaction going up and then we are going down again to touch this median line okay amazing opportunity guys amazing don't you think about it huh if, if this is not in play, if this is not the count, it's difficult to argue about something else. I, I think wave A is is in. Then we're gonna have now a B and a C. Okay, we're going. We're gonna uh, uh, go up a bit, perhaps even to this this level here, 7400. Because if we use our Fib retracement tool to see what is the the sweet spot for our wave four okay let's see it here's the okay i am proposing 38 38 20 percent okay i'm not think i don't think we're gonna get to the 50 percent okay i don't think because we had a pretty a pretty substantial wave two here and according to the alternate rules wave four don't doesn't need to be as deep because we had a deeper wave two here okay so i am i am counting on a 38 20 percent or even something or, or even less okay perhaps 23 60 percent okay it's okay so the sweet spot is around this region here okay where i market my 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 shorts okay i'm gonna start lettering it here i have my stop loss uh, okay it's exactly the 50 percent i'm gonna put a little bit higher okay i'm gonna put like uh, above this b here of this previous wave four okay but then i as i don't like to have a, a stop loss like this it's gonna be difficult if i see it going up like to the 50 uh, percent region i'm gonna ladder more okay and to to make my stop loss tighter here and to average the average my short position and i will target the same here okay i'm gonna target this region here this would be my setup okay so I, I, i'm thinking about a bullish count but it's difficult uh due to the due to the data that we have guys okay uh, you have a great opportunity here for eos okay you have this gap here this gap here shows tells us that the, the market is gonna go up here and fill this gap you see this gap here when you have this gap here in the market you see this gap it tells us that the market is gonna go up and fill this gap okay it's it, it's a lot it, it happens most of the time okay most of the time I would say 95 percent of the time but I'm I am expecting this 50 percent here to buy I am buying here Okay, I'm buying here. Perhaps I'm gonna buy a little bit here at the 90. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm gonna buy a little bit lower. This. I don't think we're gonna feel this thing now. We're gonna go lower, lower here, and then we're gonna go up. Ethereum. It's Ethereum Classic is a really awesome opportunity now. Yeah, we don't need TA to know that because of the news. Yes, and EOS as I presented you guys yesterday. It's a good opportunity because we have this tight stop loss here. 
tight stop loss and we if you bought it here you are in a profit congrats and you have a nice stop loss here that would invalidate this whole count okay um that's it i think yeah if you have questions uh suggestions feedback you can always tell me what you think and if you like my content please subscribe and like it follow me on twitter social media my twitch tv i'm gonna i'm gonna remember to do more often the, uh, streams about uh different coins altcoins and that's it okay and as always guys enjoy your trades and thanks for watching bye bye cheers